like to do that. Oh. Uh, if you're just waking up with us, we are following breaking news from southwest Detroit. Yeah, that's where a body has been found near a home after a fire. Local first Nick Monticelli just arriving there on the scene. Nick, what have you learned? So, Everett, I want to kind of paint the scene and show you exactly where we're at. Uh, photographer Josh is working the camera. Why don't we show you this direction right now, just to give you some perspective again on where we're standing. The refinery in the southwest side of Detroit is right over there on the other side of I-75. This is all happening in the neighborhood behind us. So if we come and zoom back around here, I know this is kind of an awkward moment here as we're trying to move around on live TV, but you can kind of see what's happening behind me here. Uh, there's a whole lot of cars in the way, but there used to be two homes standing directly over over there and if we zoom in you can kind of see the fire investigators working on the back side of that home over there that is where the body has been found after these two homes went up in flames and again the arson team is here they do believe all of this was intentional we can show you some video now all this is unfolding as we speak this has been going on for a couple of hours now but it wasn't until recently that we actually learned this is not just a fire not just an arson investigation this is a homicide a victim has been found behind this home with unfortunately a or limbs missing. That's the notification that we got from one of our sources. It said that limbs are missing. Now, we don't know anything beyond that. All we know is that a body was found back there. So now you've got the uh, the evidence team from the Detroit Police Department. You've got detectives out here. You've got the arson team, which is comprised of members both from Detroit Police and Detroit Fire working this as well. And you still have members of the fire department on this scene as well. This is one of those situations where they are going to be methodical in the way that they are documenting things. So as we come back out here live, you can see again those investigators working behind that home, which is on the east side of Liebold here, South Liebold in the southwest portion of Detroit. So again, a body has been found. Two homes have been burned essentially down to the ground, assumably because of arson, somebody setting those fires to try to cover up this homicide. But all those things are still things that detectives have to kind of lay out and piece together as we speak. We are live here on Detroit Southwest Side. Nick Monticelli, Local 4 News today.